Well, a Nyack man is recovering after being stranded overnight on a mountain in near freezing temperatures. Our Ben Nandy joins us now with more on what led to him being stuck and then being rescued. Ben. Beach State Park. Uh, some hikers around here telling me this at times can be pretty tricky terrain for a hike. And this story is evidence of that. Neighbors around this mountain had a heck of a day Wednesday. Early this morning, several police and fire departments responded first to locate a stranded hiker and then to rescue him. He was found several feet down a cliff from the nearest trail. He might have slid down there. I saw the helicopters and we didn't know what they were. Authorities say Mandeep Tawana, whose wife had been looking for him since he left on a hike Tuesday afternoon, was yelling for help and was noticed by someone who was jogging by. Two local high angle rescue teams responded at about 8.30 Wednesday morning. They used harnesses to pull Tawana up to a safe spot and then he was taken to the hospital. I'm not surprised. Hikers okay. Sam Mayer and Neil Surendranath say so many things can go wrong hiking on steep inclines. We've had it a few times where we've been hiking and like with the leaves and if you don't have great cell phone service on your All Trails app then all of a sudden like we've gotten off trail very easily. They tell me they often bring first aid supplies and blankets even when they're hiking in an area they know well. They say anyone can become disoriented or just slip. We always keep headlamps on us because you never know when like it might like right now become too dark and on a trail. Yeah. We should probably get started. <laughs> yes. uh... The Nyack fire chief says Tawana was alert and conscious when they caught up with him on that cliff. He also says that Tawana uh, had a head injury and hypothermia. He also says Tawana is very likely to fully recover. Ben Nandy, News 12.